What is up Cali crowd? Guys, this whole channel is about documenting the journey to mastering calisthenics techniques. I've highlighted mobility, power and balance as the attributes that I want to work on in 2020. And these three things translate to three skills that I really, really want to work on this year. And so today, I'll be walking through exactly what they are. like to join the Kelly crowd and be part of the motivating community that we are building here be sure to smash that subscribe button and ring the bell as well so you never miss out on a Kelly to the crowd video you wouldn't build a house on sand you can't run before you can walk and you shouldn't fire a cannon from a canoe the theme of this year for me and my calisthenics journey is really going to be about building foundations as I mentioned there are attributes that are really desirable when it comes to learning how to do calisthenics techniques and there are skills that will really help me unlock those attributes the first one I mentioned was mobility and the skill I'm going to use to help me build that is the ELSIT. This is one that I've really hit the ground running with. I've already started my ELSIT progress diary and quite frankly, I am so glad I started with this skill. Training for the ELSIT has already forced me to address poor hip and shoulder mobility and it's humbled me when it's come to pushing strength. If you haven't seen my ELSIT progress diary, definitely check out that playlist by clicking on the card. The second aspect of calisthenics that I want to work on in 2020 is power and the skill i'm going to use to develop this is the muscle up this is something i feel will really force me to look at developing my pulling strength which i've always thought of as being a bit decent but i've never really specifically trained for explosive pulling power so i'm expecting this technique to be a real eye opener and really help me identify areas of improvement last but not least the thing i want to round off 2020 with is balance and there is one technique that really stands out in calisthenics as requiring a lot of balance and composure yep you've guessed it the handstand balance has never ever been my forte learning how to free handstand will not only force me to look into this but will make me more aware of my body and improve posture i also like that it will help continue to drive the gains i'll acquire from learning to else it and couple that with strength built with moves such as the muscle up this is probably the technique that scares me the most. It is literally flipping my world upside down and staying in control during that chaos. All the same, I'm still gonna go through it and share my journey with you guys along the way. But Cali Crowd, I wanna know what you think. What got you into calisthenics? What exercises did you start with? What calisthenics techniques really excite you the most? Let me know in the comment section and I'll see you next time.